hi guys it's me guys and I'm back with another video as stated in the last video that I was I was I did I did stated that I was going to do a tad a little TMI and it was cute and since we all adults here well I hope I figured you guys won't mind me doing this tag um tag will be a little bit too much for your ear um be my guest okay guys now the question is do you shower or bathe and I will say that I do take a long bath daily I like bathing in the morning or in the de in the evenings too but I like to I like to detox I like to bathe and then when I'm done when I'm about to be finished then I turn on the shower and I just wash everything off so I guess you can say I do both I shower and bathe do you change your bath towel or rag daily? No, I don't change my rag or my bath towel daily. But what I do is I have a separate rag for my personal area. And then I have my separate rag for my upper body area. And then I also have another rag for my face. So, yeah. But I do change it maybe every, every three days. Do you wash up in the shower? That's a tricky question. I was trying to figure out like what do you mean with that. But I guess if you're trying to say lather, 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 yeah. Um, I do a lot of lathering, so I don't know how many times I do that. Number four, what's the longest you have ever gone without bathing or, or shower? Hmm, I don't remember guys. Um, I don't remember. I think as, as I've been on earth, that I remember I've always have to take a shower daily daily even when I had my son I was like please guys I have to take a shower so yeah um, I, yeah, I have to take a shower daily I don't know I don't think I have ever gone um, longer than a day besides the time when I gave birth to my son um, yeah that's it. do you wash up after a bowel movement it all depends if I'm home yes and if I'm home, not always either. It's kind of tricky. Now, if I'm going to take a shower and I do it, yes. If I'm already home, I use my fresh wipes. Um, they're excellent and they really clean you very well. So I keep those right next to my um, sanitary, I guess, area. Number six, do you wash up immediately after sex? Yes, I do. Seven, what products do you use for your private area, AKA vagina? Well, I use this thing called Lemisol. I know the doctors always tell you that you're not supposed to use a whole bunch of stuff down there because your body cleans itself, especially down there, which is very true. So I don't use too much. I don't use Summer Eve products because I think they're just yeah I don't know products do balance out your pH balance but for me I just eat well especially now and um, sometimes I will soak in a little bit of Benadine TMI number nine and I'm sorry guys if that was a little too TMI but I'm just keeping it 100 um, number nine do you shave all the air did you you hear my Jamaican accent came out again? Anyway, number nine, do you shave all the hair off off in your private area or just trim it? I, do, I don't shave, guys, because I get um, ingrown hairs if I, if I do. So I, get, I do Brazilian wax like every four to six weeks. Yeah, take everything off. Number 10. Do you use toilet paper or wet wipes after a bowel movement? I think I answered that question already. And I do use toilet paper, white ones, and I use um, baby wipes as well. Yeah, I do. Also, guys, that's the end for this um, this video. This you all up in my business video um, tag. And um, if you guys are wondering what I'm wearing on my eyes, I'm gonna give you a quick rundown of what I'm wearing because my subscriber she's the sweetest she's always telling me that I need to show more face of the day so I'm gonna show you even though the makeup is probably old and as you can see I'm breaking out so badly cuz I'm trying something new and it's not agreeing with my skin so in my next month well in my this month's favorite I'm gonna tell you all about it guys but I'm loving this Sephora limited um, edition 
this is what the colors look like and I'm just in love with this little palette here and this is the color that I'm using on my eyes it is the name of it they have names so the color that I'm using is called um, it's called Barbados and Belize I mix them two together these two and then I I use my Givenchy liner that I raved about in my July favorites and my Miss Manga mascara that I rave about as well and this blush that I love now from Wet n Wild it's called uh, what, what is this called? What is it? No, you all know about this one. I think it's called something pink. Heather red pink or something like that. Guys, I'm, if I don't, if I, if I can't remember it now, and if I do, by the time I upload this video, I will annotate it. But this is the cheeks, and of course my mineralized um, in dark mineralized skin finish from Mac and Dark, and I'm wearing my Hush Hush. <laughs> my Hush um, OCC um, with the brush. I just put a little bit of this because it's so, so, so pigmented. So I use a little bit of this in the center with my cork lip liner and of course my um, Beer, Beer Secrets. Obsessed. Obsessed with this thing. And that's all I'm wearing on my face, guys. And also because I've been breaking out so bad, I've, I use the... Um, Anastasia concealer in 6.5 to to you know take away like to conceal a little bit of my my um this is what it looked like and I love this concealer so much guys this concealer I don't know why it's not getting so much the ray that it deserves or uh, maybe a lot of people not knowing about this but have you guys never tried the Anastasia Beverly Hills concealers full coverage very creamy I just love it very much I'm going to do a review on that as well and my other ones. I have about three of them. I use some to um, highlight, which I'm not wearing now, but I do use um, the the 6.0 to highlight. And then this I use to conceal my blemishes. And, and that's it. I hope you guys like this tag. And I'm going to tag everybody that has a YouTube channel. When you get a chance, do this tag. It's, it's fun. It's all fun, guys. Bye, guys. Kisses.